There are three methods of organic weed control that we use. One of them is flame weeding, and that's great for pavers, it's great for gravel driveways, and you can also use it in the general garden. And of course, there's always hand weeding, and for that we use a garden fork, or we'll use this little hoe. Today we're looking at an organic weed killer. It's an alternative to Roundup, it's non-selective, so it will kill all the weeds it comes in contact with, and it's called Slasher. Slasher is a plant-based weed killer. It actually kills the foliage, so you probably need two or three applications to kill the weed completely. It's applied through a sprayer, and the rate of application is 70 mils per litre. We're going to trial this in a number of situations, so let's have a look. Before you start spraying, set your spray head. You don't want a fine mist that can drift if it's windy and you don't want too strong a stream so that you're wasting the product. So something in between, sort of like this. So here we have an area that's been mulched and you can see there are weeds already coming up through the mulch and we'd like to knock those back. You can also use it in gravel driveways and paths if you wish to get rid of weeds and moss. And this is great because you don't have to dig and you're not using any poisons. And of course, the general weeds. When you're using Slasher, the foliage should be dry. The idea is that the foliage gets a complete coverage. So there we have an area done beneath what are two newly planted avocado trees. And as you can see, the weeds have almost disappeared completely. If you are going to put down mulch, we recommend that you spray with Slasher before you put the mulch down and do that two or three times then put the mulch down you'll find that the weeds really struggle to come back here's our veggie garden and we don't like weeds around the edge of the veggie garden because it attracts snails and slugs so we'll just go along here with the slasher and we'll see how that works this is a gravel path or actually a driveway and this is the area that we sprayed with slasher and it's knocked those weeds back almost completely. A second application probably won't be needed for this one. You can see the area that we haven't sprayed here. Tough weeds like this thistle, and it's knocked that one back completely. And some normal run-of-the-mill grass type weeds, we'll spray them, and this is what they look like. They've died right back. Recommended application rates are on the label, and in our case, at 70 mils per litre of water. When spraying Slasher, take the necessary safety precautions, wear some gloves, wear some eye protection, follow the safety instructions that are on the packet. Our top tips when using Slasher, always spray when the foliage is dry, always mix the solution up at the recommended application rate, adjust the stream on your sprayer before you add the Slasher to the water, Always wear gloves and other protective equipment as recommended. Don't apply Slasher if it's likely to rain within 24 hours. Check over the area that you've sprayed. If weeds start to reappear, spray them again as needed. And if you're interested, we have a separate video on flame weeding. Subscribe to the YouTube channel for regular updates on all aspects of gardening. And as always, good luck with your gardening.